So you know how you felt when you were a little kid and there was this girl you liked and you were just terrified to ask her would she go out with you, but you ask her anyway, right? You get the courage. You ask her and she says yes. And you just feel so excited that you don't know what to do with yourself. That's how I felt when I finally sat down to watch Doctor Strange. Is that pathetic? Bar side movie reviews. When I sat down in my seat the other day, I really did have kind of a nervous energy that is really almost unexplainable. That's how excited I was about this film. I really did feel like a little kid or that guy going on that first date with the girl that he just knew was gonna say no, but she said yes. That's the kind of feelings I had when I sat down to watch Doctor Strange. My anticipation level for this thing was so high because I really needed this to be good because I have been a Doctor Strange fan since I have been a little kid. So this movie is directed by Scott Dickerson. It stars Benedict Cumberbatch as Doctor Strange. I'm going to try not to get this name too butchered or butcher this name too badly. Chiwetel Ford. I think is how you pronounce that name. It also stars Rachel McAdams. It also stars Tilda Swinton and it also stars Mads Mikkelsen. Okay you guys so let's jump right in with the synopsis of Doctor Strange. No spoilers of course. So Doctor Strange is an origin story. It tells the story of Stephen Strange who is a neurosurgeon who goes on a journey to find healing. Something happens to him and he's looking to be healed and while he's on that journey he encounters the mystic arts and from then on his life is about to take a turn that he could have never Never imagine. Okay, so the first place you have to start with in this film is this film cinematically. Visually, this thing was amazing. And Marvel told us that we were not going to see anything like we have seen in any of the other MCU movies in this, and they did not lie. This thing is visually amazing. You've not seen anything close to it in Thor, the Avengers, any of the Iron Mans, any of the movies, Ant Mans, all of them. You haven't seen anything so visually impactful as what you've seen in Doctor Strange, which is really nice, right? Because Doctor Strange introduces the magical element into the MCU, and it gives us a glimpse of what it's like to operate in his world, and it is absolutely stunning. It is on a different level than what we've seen in any of the other Marvel movies. And I'm going to tell you, there were some times when I was watching some of the scenes in this movie, and just visually, just looking at it, I was just like, wow. It was absolutely incredible to see and experience. Oh, so let me say, you have to see this movie in 3D. This is just like the perfect movie made for 3D. You know how you see some movies that are in 3D and you're like, why did I pay the extra four or three bucks or whatever to see it in 3D? This is worth every bit of it. It is an experience in 3D. Visually, this film is stunning. All right, so let's talk about the storyline in this film because some people have complained that there was too much exposition in this film and too much uh, having Doctor Strange on the screen and kind of talking about how he was instead of actually building enough uh, development in his backstory. I personally did not have a problem with that. I thought that the story was told in such a way where they gave us enough information about Doctor Strange to kind of understand what his personality was like. They consistently showed it throughout the film, so I didn't have a problem with that. It would have been nice to see a little bit more character development with some of the other characters in the film. So that may have been nice and I would have been okay with that as long as it didn't mess up the pacing of the film because this movie paces pretty well for, uh, for how long this film is. So the film does a good job though of having a worthy adversary. You know exactly what his motivations are and he is a worthy adversary. Mads Mikkelsen in this film is a beast not to be played with. Tilda Swinton does a great job as the Ancient One. People were complaining that uh, she was not like the Ancient One in the comic book. So what? She does a fabulous job in this movie. You'll see when you see it, you'll see what I mean. You'll definitely appreciate her as the Ancient One. Everything goes pretty well in this script. I thought it had nice comic relief. I thought as a whole the story was interesting. And when you couple the story with the visuals, then you get the amazing film that Doctor Strange is. And I'm not surprised that it is getting the ratings that it's getting because because when the two come together, which is what happens when you have good movie making, it produces an awesome movie and one that's very fun to watch. Even if you don't like comic books, I think that you will like this movie. The acting in this movie was really good. Everybody did such a fabulous job. I really enjoyed actually Benedict Wong, 
who has a smaller role in the movie, but he does a really good job in this film as well. So this movie was really, really good. Very entertaining. It did not disappoint. I'm glad I didn't wait for months and months and months only to get a film that was a flop. I really enjoyed this film. I am giving Doctor Strange an A- Minus. This is one that you definitely want to see in the theaters in 3D. I'm going to say that again. In the theaters in 3D. Make sure you make room for your Blu-ray too because you want to add this to your collection. As always, you guys, thank you so much for taking the time out to watch this video. I really, really do appreciate it. If you have not subscribed, please consider doing so. Become a far sider. Lend your voice to, uh, to the community as we talk about movies. If you like this, give it a thumbs up. And please make sure that you comment. And I will see you on the next video. Bye-bye. Hey, you guys. It's Al again. And I just wanted to say thanks again for taking the time out to watch my review of Doctor Strange. You guys got to check this movie out. If you like this review, please make sure that you give it a thumbs up. And make sure that you comment. Share your thoughts on the film. Make sure that you subscribe. You can see that button right down there. As well as my social media links, which are right there to the right. And my latest review that you guys can check out. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Take care, and I will see you on the next video. Bye-bye.